today and tomorrow. You will take the reading test. You will have two hours each day for a total of four hours to complete this reading test. It is a reading test. You need to read the passages. Read them more than once. When you look at the questions, go back and look at the passage again. Give yourselves the chance to find the answers in the passage to make sure that you are right. It's not about getting it done, it's about getting it right. So really please make sure you're doing your best and reading those passages carefully and reading the questions very carefully to make sure you know what is being asked of you. You're taking the reading test and as Mrs. Covillo said, you need to read it and read it more than a month. When you're reading, be sure that you are looking for words you don't know and look for context clues. That's looking for around that word to figure out the meaning. Also, use your background knowledge. Remember, back here, everything you've had and learned for 14 years of your life, use that plus the passage to make the best answer. Once you leave that passage and you answer all the questions attached to that passage, you can't go back. So be sure you complete each section before moving on. Then, watch your time. Be sure you check the clock. Um, when you've got only 10 minutes left, be sure you go back and don't open up a new passage. You'll do great. You're going to do wonderful. We believe in you. Remember you have tools to use. There is the dictionary tool and the strike through tool. So make sure you utilize everything that is given to you. Also, don't forget to check your answers before you move on to the next section. Okay, you guys, so this is it. Two hours, two days, you can do this. Read carefully, answer questions carefully, check your answers, do everything you've been taught all year long, not to mention the previous years. You can do this. It's going to be challenging. It's designed to be challenging. You are just looking to show growth and improvement. You've got this.